What's up guys? This is Bruce and I'm coming back with another comic book haul. Um I just got a new camera so I'm trying it out. So please forgive me for any mistakes. I'm learning how to do this stuff. Um I went to a couple different stores and I want to give a shout out real quick to my buddy Comic Brains. Check out his channel. And uh, he's got some really awesome stuff. He's a real big Michael Turner fan. He's really big into X-Men. So for you guys that are into that stuff, that like that work, um, I recommend you go check out his channel. Um, me and him went out to a place called Captain Comics. And um, <clears throat> I got a couple of, couple of books. This book right here, Batgirl issue 16, I got at a, like a bookstore called uh twice told tales I, I believe i forget because it's two stores back to back that are huge bookstores go figure but anyway this is bat uh, bat girl issue 16 part of the death of the family this cover is by uh bendez but i just love this cover man and it's just badass there's another issue that i'm trying to get with uh ventriloquist and i seen it so i'm gonna go back and uh go pick that up but uh yeah this is the first one i'm gonna start off with uh i just love this cover the new 52 you know anything with batman is just to me gold uh this right here is uh a michael turner cover and uh let me try to adjust this real quick so you guys can... all right um hulk issue 7 variant and um it's just badass cover. Michael Turner is an uh, awesome artist, and it's unfortunate that he passed away so young. But um, his artwork is amazing. So I picked this up, and I picked this up, I think, for $1.75. And this is when I went with uh, Comic Brains down to uh, Captain Comics. So these next few issues, this is what I picked up there. I also picked up there, which whew, I'm so happy. I found two copies, but I gave the other copy to him. I wanted to be fair. I would have snatched up all of them. Trust me, I would have. Take them all if I could. Hulk, issue number one, the first appearance of the Red Hulk. One of my favorite covers. I think it's badass. And I bought this book for less than two bucks. And um, it's going on eBay. I've seen it go for about $20, $25. I also got uh, Scooby-Doo Team Up 15 featuring the Flash. I think this is just funny. <laughs> He's just stealing their food. Just choom, They don't even know what's going on. I just love that cover, man. It's just so badass. Also, I got a... I don't know um, which one exactly, but this is uh, Power Rangers issue number one. I think this is the villain cover. I don't know if it's a 1 in 10 or 1 in 25, so if somebody knows and can leave it in the comment section, that would be awesome, because I would like to know. Especially when you're showing off comics to somebody or people, you would like to know the correct information about something. You don't want to come incorrect, you know, looking like a fool or whatever. I got, this is an eBay purchase, and I finally got it. I heard uh, when uh, uh, a rumor about old man logan movie that omega red's gonna be in here and the phantom x if i said that correctly is also gonna be in there so i would definitely recommend this book if you don't have it it's fairly cheap you can get this at the dollar bin i didn't pay a dollar for it i think i paid about six bucks with it most of it was shipping um it's a real badass cover man jim lee man he he's no joke man he he knows what he's doing Also, and I left the the price tag up there. Um, it was seventeen dollars, fifty percent off. So, you know, do the math. Eight fifty, I think it is. Yeah. Uh, Origin of the Red Skull. Um, it's got a good. I would, you know, say it's around there. Good, very good. You know, it's got some. Uh, play with my camera now. See if I could zoom in there. Ha <laughs> ha! This is. Oh 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 sorry guys 
had an ink in, they drew some hair on the guy's chest, they colored uh, the star out of Captain America, they drew some teeth on, uh, on some Red Skull. Um, I'm happy to have it. Tales of Suspense issues 66. Also, I found at Captain Comics. So, not only did I find two of the regular covers, I found this one as well. The variant, which this one's going for a lot more. I've seen this go for about almost 40 bucks, 30 bucks. And this is the variant, and I think this is my favorite cover compared to the regular cover. So, yeah, I'm so happy that I found this one. And I also paid, I think, uh, less than two bucks for this one. So, very happy about that one. Nova issue number three, first appearance of Diamond Head. I'm very happy to find this one. I've been looking for this one for a long time. And uh, I paid two twenty five for this one. So it says very good. I think it's uh, in better shape than that. You know, looks really good. I have to look in the inside. I have not looked in the inside, so that's probably could be why, or maybe they're just real cautious with their grading. Because this one looks really good, and and uh, for the price that I paid for it, see it right there. I'm I'm very happy. You know, you never know. Diamond Head might be in the movie. Uh, another one that I. I like um, Comic Brains was debating to whether even to get this one, so he put it back, and I just picked it up. This is the first appearance of Jessica Jones' baby, and with the show on Netflix already, and you got Luke Cage coming on Netflix, and uh, who else is going? What else is going on? My brain's still blah. Whatever, but I paid I think a dollar ten cents for it. Key issue, uh, Michael Bendez. Can't go wrong with that. I picked it up. Lucifer 66. I like Lucifer. The show is badass. So I picked it up. I thought it was the last issue, but uh, I think I was wrong on that one. Uh, this was on an eBay purchase. Uh, Mr. Freeze is now on the Gotham show. So I picked this up. And, uh, unfortunately, it's a Toys R Us edition. I'm trying to get the first appearance, man, but, wow, it, it's it's pretty high up there for, you know, low to mid-grade. So, you know, patience is a virtue, and, a, and, uh, and if you want some, you will get it. And, like, my buddy uh, Chris from We Like Love Comics, he's like, if you want it, you're going to get it one day. So, I take that as a little motivation. But these last two books are uh, my favorite compared to all these books that I'm showing here like I said I'm a big turtles fan so um these are dollar bin books probably but I bought these on eBay because I was having a tough time finding them and I and I wanted them and I'm still trying to acquire number one and uh, I just don't want to pay the price that they're looking asking for it so I'll just wait a little bit but I, I will get it and uh Tales of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, issue number four. This is the first appearance of Rat King. He's my favorite villain besides Shredder and Bebop and Rocksteady, obviously. And uh, I don't know why they'll never do nothing with Rat King. Yeah, it, unfortunate, I think. I think he's an underrated villain. And um, I think they need to use this guy really bad, man. And uh, I just love the cover. And last but not least, Teenage Tales of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, issue number six. And this is the first appearance of Leatherhead, another good villain that uh, they need to use, hopefully in this movie. Besides Krang and Bebop and Rocksteady, hopefully they'll put somebody in there. You don't want to overcrowd with a bunch of different villains. You want to just slowly but surely put them in there. But hopefully they do something with it. Well, anyway, that's my haul. Um, I'm gonna go more. I'm gonna go looking for more comics today. Uh, 
If you guys enjoyed the video, hit the thumbs up. Um, if you guys are not subscribed to We Love Comics, he's got a Tuesday night show you want to check out. Uh, subscribe to his videos. Captain Cummins, subscribe to his videos. And once again, check out my buddy Comic, Bo uh, Comic Brains. He's got some real awesome stuff. I suggest you check it out. Um, hope you guys find some nice treasures in your comic book hunting. This is Bruce signing off. This is Cowabunga Comics and Collectibles. Cowabunga!